Hi, I'm Richie. I'm the owner of Rigs by Richie. I was working for a company refitting garages out. Did that for a year and then Jamie at CrossFit Northumbria at the time, our method training, he came to me and asked if I could do uh, a refit with him. I helped him out for a good six weeks from Jim Martin to Riggs to Cladden. In the middle of that I met a lad called Paul Walsh. Uh, Paul's the owner of Northam and Shepherdhook Co, uh, which is where I work now. Lockdown happened last year. Um, um, I got a message on uh, a Friday night um, of Paul basically saying uh, we'll have to close the business due to the COVID restrictions. It'll be at least six to seven weeks of uh, no work for me. So obviously being gutted, a bit heartbroken, um, thinking I would have no job uh, or no job to go back to. Um, couldn't get my head around it. I didn't know what I'd do uh, for a job to earn some money. So I was out with the dogs with Tess and I couldn't uh, stop thinking about it. Um, I was thinking about going in the army. I was thinking about joining the Royal Marines. I even talked to the career officer um, online and spoke to them on the phone. That was nearly my career until one night at method training and I was just finishing off a session and a, a lad came up to us, Ben, asking if I could fit a pull-up bar for him. Jamie gave him a pull-up bar and told him which he was a guy to help you out. So he came to me and I bit his hand off and I said, yeah, of course, I'll sort it out for you, mate. Um, on the Tuesday, I had one day off uh, in this lockdown and I got told off by Tessa for not sitting down because I, I just need to do stuff. I, I'm always on my feet, I need to do something. So I'm really pleased Ben asked me to, to fit his rig. Fitted his rig and obviously got some photos and stuck it on my Facebook and Instagram, just on my private accounts. And sure enough, a couple of lads from the gym, Gav, uh, Ben Vanschflower, uh, one of the coaches, both asked for the rig, uh, the same rig as Ben's. Um, so I installed those two rigs and at the meantime my mate Chris, uh, Chris Kirk, he's the owner of Wadland. He also wanted the rig in his garden due to all the gyms being closed so we created a metal rig and that was the first rig of its kind, uh, the very first one. Uh, next door at the Shepherd Huts there was a blacksmith and I used this blacksmith for at least three or four months of lockdown. I was really happy to help him out with work. He had nothing going on at the time also, so we worked together for, like I say, three or four months and knocked out um, a load of rigs. After going live on Facebook and Instagram, um, that day my phone was lighting up and I was getting messages left, right and centre. Um, so I decided to take a little risk and buy a load of posts and metal pull-up bars and sure enough those five uh, posts and bars were sold within uh, I would say half an hour to an hour um, and then my calendar started getting booked up. Uh, the likes of Aaron Green and Hesus from Anik, um, they also wanted a rig installed which I think pushed my, uh, my rigs out to the, the CrossFit community so thanks to them my name was, was flying around uh, social media. And then there was just one evening, Dave Shentz um, gave me a ring and basically said, I think this could be a, a big thing. You should uh, get a Facebook and an Instagram made up and create a little company. So I spoke to Dave for five minutes, 10 minutes. We, uh, we were back and forwards with some names and came up with the name Rigs by Richie. And obviously wanted a logo, uh, something simple, something that resembled me. And Dave came up with the logo I've got now. Uh, so a big thanks to Dave Shenton. So from fitting uh, garden rigs, um, seven days a week, uh, 12 hours a day. Uh, now I am fitting um, full gyms. Um, lately gyms like District 5 in Morpeth. Um, Live barbells, 
uh, primal strength, uh, just name a few. So what's next for Rigs by Richie? Um, fitting more rigs and refitting uh, big gyms. Um, yeah. So I get asked this question quite a lot. Um, I would say at least 12 muscle-ups a day. <laughs>